Welcome to our channel, Science in a Nutshell, for juniors 4, 5, and 6. Light and Sight So, have you ever wondered why when you enter a room with no light source, your eyes are not able to see? Because the eye is the organ which is affected by light in humans and animals. For human, you will always need a source of light, like a candle, electric lamp, sun, which is the main source of light on Earth, or you need fire, and so on. So to see, you need a source of light. But what about the nocturnal animals, or the animals who always are active at night? Nocturnal animals means the animals active at night. What they are going to do? They need to hunt in the dark. They are active at night, so they need to know where their prey is. And they need to see if there is danger around them so they can run. So how they can see when there is no light source? Well, let me just tell you two examples of these animals that we are going to study. First, we have the fishing cat. It's a wild cat that hunts during night time as the structure of its eyes helps it to find its prey in the dark. So it has a structural adaptation in their eyes. The fishing cat's eye seems to glow in the dark and that's because they have a mirror-like membrane on the back of their eyes. When the light enters its eye, it bounces off this membrane, allowing the eye to collect. to focus on far away or near objects. I think that you now know the differences between human eyes and nocturnal animal eyes. So, nocturnal animals have bigger eyes, which are more sensitive to light than humans. The pupils of their eyes are usually open wider than the pupils of human's eye, and this is to allow more light enters. Nocturnal animals can detect the environment around them in the weakest light levels, but in complete darkness, they depend on other senses, such as hearing, touching, and smell, that help them hunt and move in the dark. 